Hello everyone, it's me ASMR welcoming you to my new Photoshop tutorials. Today I'll discuss about you the modern lime type color and I'll provide you that download link in my video description and I will explain why I use the settings over there. So let's start the tutorial. If you're new in my channel, please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications. So I'm closing it up and I'll open up image which is really this type of image. So here the stock image I downloaded from unsplash.com and I'll provide you the download link in my video description. So this photo for the stock image so at first press ctrl or command j you will get the another copy of this layer filter and camera filter camera filter is another plugins of the photoshop which is really helpful to us for the editor who can edit the photo and you can uh, just edit like the lightroom and you can use the xmp file into uh, the lightroom and the photoshop so here the small menu load settings option i made a preset already the lime modern and load it up so you'll get the instant changes of this so why uh, this type of change appearing so let's see the settings here the basic options here the basic temperature minus 11 and tint minus 50 and the exposure plus 0 0.02 and the contrast plus 24 and highlights minus 54 and shadow minus 2 and whites plus 13 and blacks plus 7 and the texture plus 6 and the dehaze plus 10 that's good and vibrance that's why you are getting the vibrant look uh, plus 13 and the saturation plus 2 that's good and the curves i didn't use the curves in this case and detailing options here the sharpening detail 48 and all the stuffs are by default and here the noise reduction 24 and all the stuffs are by default and the color noise reduction here that is 58 so these ty two types of noise reduction color noise and the normal noise so color noise reduction will help you out to make this photo smoother and then the color mixture here the hue saturation luminance hue which color will be it defines with this value and the saturation percentage of the color and luminance the intensity of the color hue uh, plus 38 and the green minus 23 and the saturation that is minus 11 and orange minus 24 and the greens minus 15 and the blue minus 100 purple minus 100 and magenta minus 100 that's good and the luminance that is the intensity of the color the red intensity plus 27 orange plus 26 and the yellow plus 26 and minus 28 for the green and here the aqua plus 19 you are getting the aqua color over here and the blues plus 14 and the purple plus 13 that's good and let's go to the color grading here the shadow color at first shadow color value which is uh, 295 in case this triangle could be like that and just press over here you will get the three things over there and that means it is expanded now 120 um, now 295 is the value of the color which is the hue and the saturation which is the percentage 18 that's good and the shadow just done mid tone uh, 333 that is the color code for the hue and the saturation 17 and the highlight that is uh, 115 the saturation love and that's good uh, optics geometry and effects i use the little bit effects which is for the post crop vignetting minus nine that's good and the calibration which is minus um, 24 for the red primary and the green primary plus 59 and the blue primary i made the hue minus 19 and the saturation nine that's all for this preset and hit the ok button it will take time to load it up and providing you the final output the before one and after one the modern lime type photo so let's try this piece to another type of categories photo so going to the file and open up uh, suppose you have this type of photo yeah this type of photo press ctrl or command j and then go to the filter camera filter and go to the load settings options and insert the modern lime you're getting this type of effects so how you can manage this one so go to the basic options make the vibrance down okay and then here you can change up so the tint you can change it up the tint will be like this and the temperature you can change it up so you are getting extra new look of this and hit the ok button so before and after and here the before and after so hope that you learn a lot from this video if you did please thumbs up and share with your friend and if you have any kind of question query request please do comment on my video comment section and until the next video i'm asmr signing out today stay safe stay at home keep me in your prayers as well Bye bye